Today, a six-week-old French bulldog is arriving from the local vets, having been abandoned by a breeder. You want to come on in? If you can just tell me what's happened with Kevin, why he's come into your care. So he unfortunately stopped eating on the Saturday, so he became quite dehydrated quite quickly, got quite poorly. Mm. Um, so he came into us not really wanting to eat, not wanting to move. Money was a bit of an issue, so yeah. that's why he ended up being signed over, bless him. I think he was one of the smaller ones to start off with, so I don't think he had a great start. Oh, it's just so sad that he's had to be so poorly, like, just yeah, the beginning of his, not a good start. Of his life, and now he's away from all his friends. You know, you could make thousands of pounds off one litter of French Bulldogs, so um, you would hope that a small price to pay would be some vet bills for a poorly puppy. Um, but there's just some breeders that won't, won't do that. They don't want a vet bill, they just want the dogs to make money off them. We're all getting booked in with our vets here, so I'll take him off your hands. Yeah. Thank you for taking no, such good care for of me. Oh my God, what's going on? <laughs> Bye, Kev. <laughs> Does he not know what it is? What about this really interesting toy here? When you work in Poppy Block, it's not all about you know, the fluffy, happy eight-week-old puppy that comes in and we can coo over and I can parade and be like, oh, look at my puppy, everyone. A lot of the time, it's picking up pieces, boosting the emotional welfare of dogs that have been really severely let down by human beings. He is certainly, certainly getting bigger, getting stronger. So he is going to be on a mission to find a cosy lap. Good boy. Obviously, you're here to get a dog. Yes. <laughs> Have you had a dog before at all? Um, no, it would be our first dog together. Okay. First time dog owners. And have you got an idea of what sort of dog you're looking for? Ideally, something small. Uh, you know, companionable. Yeah. yeah. And quite sociable as well. Uh, like a to, to the With pub. A bit of and, character. Yeah. I, I like. Something, if it was in a Disney film, it would be like the leader of the dogs. <laughs> oh, the OK, leader of the pack. <laughs> With a name like Frank. Yeah. Something like that. Yeah. Exactly. Yes. I okay. want Frank. Yeah. That's what I want. <sighs> Tired. Yeah. Because of the chemotherapy, we might not be able to have children. You feel like your body has sort of betrayed you. So the thought that we might not it sort of breaks my heart. You never actually get told like it is in the films. You never get told you have cancer. I was getting these mad headaches and was uh, getting dizzy spells. Went to this uh, guy privately. He took one look in my eyes and was just like, you need a scan, ASAP. Uh, and I just had a tumour in the middle of my head. Had to go in for an operation that evening, which is the scar that I've got there. Uh, and then a big operation to remove it, which is on the back of my head there, which took nine hours. I had chemotherapy, I went through the whole gamut. But it was just one of those things where you sort of shut down and just get through the next period until you are well again. <gasps> oh. Holy Hello. moly. Hello. Oh, sweet baby Jesus. He's tiny, isn't he? He's the cutest thing I've ever seen. Here you go, darling. Hello. 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 Oh, you are soft as velvet. His little snufflings. My friends are starting to have children, and my heart does hurt a bit, knowing that that's probably not going to be our path. Hello. <laughs> yeah. But, you know, we're Laurel and Hardy. We're, you know, Thelma and Louise. <laughs> yeah, we both help each other through. Can I be your mummy? Would it be all right with you? He is a tiny piggy dream. Oh, you're just a little bag of sugar. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 
Aww. It's very hard not to dote <laughs> yeah. on a tiny little puppy like that. So being adorable is just hard work, isn't it? <laughs> to have two beautiful little pups to choose yeah. from, if I could take them both, I would. They're both absolutely yeah. delightful. Got a lot of thinking to do. Ah, oh dear. What a day.